Hey guys! So the Academy Awards are coming up next month, so we decided we'd do a short series to try and figure out which one of the Best Picture nominees will win. So we're going to take a look at each one individually and we'll talk about what the chances are of it winning. So, for the first episode of Will It Win, Dave, what are we talking about? We are talking about the World War II computer science movie, The Imitation Game. This movie starring the amazing Benedict Cumberbatch as Alan Turing, the man who's widely regarded as the father of artificial intelligence. And this is a real life story about him and a team of guys in the middle of World War II. And one girl. And one girl, thank you, during World War II, trying to break the Enigma machine, which mm -hmm. was this Nazi code machine that essentially let the Nazis just run all over the world creating chaos and no one could stop them because they couldn't break it until Alan Turing showed up. Now, The Imitation Game isn't just nominated for Best Picture. It is also nominated for Best Actor, Best Director, Best Supporting Actress, Best Adapted Screenplay, Best Editing, Best Production Design, and Best Original Score. That's a lot. It is, and I'm pretty sure I got them all. Yes, and Best Movie starring Benedict Cumberbatch in 2014. Is that That is an Academy Award, right? If not, it will be in the next couple yeah, of years. Yeah, we're going to have to write that one in. And we should, because Benedict Cumberbatch is amazing mm -hmm. in this movie. And, uh, you know, I don't know if he'll actually win the Academy Award for Best Actor. There's a lot of great Best Actor noms yeah. this year. So, Dave, let's talk about one reason that we think that it could win. Yeah, well, I think the main reason this can win is it's about this guy who is a real hero mm -hmm. in so many ways. First off, he's a hero to the many lives that were saved in World War II thanks to him spearheading uh, the Turing machine. Yeah, I mean, without him, the war probably would have gone on for much longer. Exactly. And not only that, but also he was uh, unjustly persecuted uh, for really just based on hatred and bigotry and some really messed up laws yeah. in England uh, back during the 40s and 50s. Yeah, and it wasn't until just recently that he was even pardoned. And, you know, it's long after his death. I mean, you watch this movie, and you're pretty much like, yo, this dude is computer Jesus. <laughs> I mean, really, right? Uh, yeah, in a way. He pretty much is. So, uh, what do you think its chances are of winning? Chances of winning, I say, are 50-50. It is very good, uh, and, uh, you know, it's great to have real-life stories, but at the same time, I'm not sure it's got that special something that movies like Boyhood mm -hmm. uh, have, or, you know, maybe even Birdman. Yeah. But it is a strong contender, uh, but this year is full of these great biopics of all these really important people, some in war, uh, some, you know, civil rights. So it's going to be a really interesting year. Yeah. And a couple in science. Exactly. Yeah. And a kid playing drums. And a hotel. <laughs> in World War Two. No, World War One. And World War something. A former superhero. Exactly. You Played can't go wrong. Played by a former superhero. <laughs> exactly. Acting with. A former superhero. And, of course, Imitation Game is starring a future superhero. The movie's fantastic. I think what's really amazing about it is the fact that it's really, really interesting, and it's a movie about code breaking. Yeah. They somehow make it thrilling and engrossing when really it could have been a very boring TV movie. Yeah, absolutely. I agree with you. I think it has about a 50-50 chance of winning. Um, I do think that, that some of the other contenders are stronger, but really, you never know what's going to hit with people. Exactly. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. Make sure to check back on this channel because we will be talking about every Best Picture nominee before the Academy Awards airs February 22nd. Yeah, and let us know in the comments down below what you thought of the imitation game and who you think is going to win the, the Academy Award for Best Picture. Exactly. And guys, while you're watching this on YouTube, on your computer, or on your tablet, or on your smartphone, don't forget to take a second to thank Alan Turing mm -hmm. for computers. Yeah, and AI. And helping stop World War II. Possibly future Terminators. And Doctor Strange? Yeah. Why not? Bye!